Hello everyone and welcome to another episode on 10 mathematicians you must really know about. Number 1. Leonard Euler Leonard Euler is arguably the greatest mathematician of all time. His work encompasses all mathematics, nearly all physics, and a significant part of astronomy, an astonishing fraction of the total research in mathematics and physical science carried out between 1730 and 1780 was solely Euler's work. Although he lost vision in one eye, his remarkable mathematical flow continued without interruption. In fact, it increased. Euler worked in almost all areas of mathematics such as geometry, infinitesimal calculus, trigonometry, algebra, number theory, continuum physics, lunar theory and other areas of physics. He is a seminal figure in the history of mathematics. If printed, his works, many of which are of fundamental interest, would occupy between 60 and 80 quarto volumes. It has been proposed that Euler was responsible for a third of all the scientific and mathematical output of the 18th century. Euler's name is associated with a large number of topics. Euler's work averages 800 pages a year from 1725 to 1783. He wrote over 4,500 letters and hundreds of manuscripts. It has been estimated that Leonard Euler was the author of a quarter of the combined output in mathematics, physics, mechanics, astronomy and navigation in the 18th century. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 2. Carl Friedrich Gauss Johann Carl Friedrich Gauss is sometimes called the prince of mathematicians and the greatest mathematician since antiquity. There are few people who have had an impact on the world quite like the 18th century German mathematician Carl Friedrich Gauss. His work can be seen in many fields including algebra, astronomy, geometry, modular arithmetic and physics. The unit that gives the definition of magnetic flux density is one of many things named in his honor. Gauss was a child prodigy. At the age of 7, he is reported to have amazed his teachers by summing the integers from 1 to 100 almost instantly. He made several important contributions in major areas of mathematics, most notably in number theory, especially on prime numbers. He went on to prove the fundamental theorem of algebra and introduced the Gaussian gravitational constant in physics, as well as much more, all this before he was 24. He was a perfectionist, he didn't publish much of his work, preferring to rework and improve theorems first. His revolutionary discovery of non-Euclidean space was found in his notes after his death. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 3. Pierre Simon Laplace Pierre Simon Laplace was a French scholar and polymath whose work was important to the development of engineering, mathematics, statistics, physics, astronomy and philosophy. He summarized and extended the work of his predecessors in his five-volume Celestial Mechanics. This work translated the geometric study of classical mechanics to one based on calculus, opening up a broader range of problems. In statistics, the Bayesian interpretation of probability was developed mainly by Laplace. Laplace formulated Laplace equations and pioneered the Laplace transform which appears in many branches of mathematical physics, a field he took a leading role in forming. The Laplacian differential operator widely used in mathematics is also named after him. He restated and developed the nebula hypothesis of the origin of the solar system and was one of the first scientists to suggest an idea similar to that of a black hole. Laplace is regarded as one of the greatest scientists of all time, sometimes referred to as the French Newton or Newton of France. He was Napoleon's examiner when Napoleon attended the Eco Militaire in Paris in 1784. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 4. Joseph Louis Lagrange Lagrange was an Italian and French who made major contributions to mathematics and physics. One of the world's greatest mathematicians, 
his most important work analytical mechanics liberated the science of mechanics from geometry by expressing the laws of motion in a form that could be manipulated algebraically without resource to diagrams. Lagrange is also credited with the invention of the calculus of variations, the employment of which led to some of his most important mathematical discoveries. In 1755, Lagrange sent Euler a letter in which he discussed the calculus of variations. Euler was deeply impressed by Lagrange's work. He held back his own work on the subject to let Lagrange publish first. Although Euler and Lagrange never met, when Euler left Berlin for St. Petersburg in 1766, he recommended that Lagrange succeed him as the director of the Berlin Academy. Throughout a long and celebrated career, he would be ironized by Mary Antoinette and made a count by Napoleon before his death. Lagrange also did significant work on the three-body problem and astronomical perturbations. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 5. Augustin Louis Cauchy Augustin Louis Cauchy was a French mathematician, engineer and physicist who made pioneering contributions to several branches of mathematics including mathematical analysis and continuum mechanics. He was one of the first to state and rigorously prove theorems of calculus rejecting the heuristic principle of generality of algebra of earlier authors. He almost single-handedly founded complex analysis and the study of permutation groups in abstract algebra. Hans Frodenthal stated, more concepts and theorems have been named for Cauchy than for any other mathematician. In elasticity alone, there are 16 concepts and theorems named for Cauchy. Cauchy was a prolific writer. He wrote approximately 800 research articles and 5 complete textbooks on a variety of topics in the fields of mathematics and mathematical physics. Due to his praiseworthy contributions to wave propagation, which is an important part of hydrodynamics, he received the prestigious Grand Prix from the Institute of France. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 6. Bernard Riemann The name Bernard Riemann is well known to mathematicians and physicists around the world. This influential German mathematician contributed challenging new ideas and concepts to mathematics. His fundamental contributions to mathematics include number theory, differential equations, real and complex analysis, differential geometry, and more. In the field of real analysis, he is mostly known for the first rigorous formulation of the integral, the Riemann integral, and for his work on the Fourier series. His contributions to complex analysis include most notably the introduction of the Riemann surfaces, breaking new ground in a natural geometric treatment of complex analysis. His 1859 paper on the prime counting function containing the original statement of the Riemann hypothesis is regarded as a foundational paper of analytic number theory. Through his pioneering contributions to differential geometry, Riemann laid the foundations of the mathematics of general relativity. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 7. Niels Henrik Abel Niels Henrik Abel was a Norwegian mathematician. Niels went to the cathedral school at 13 in 1815. He had the good fortune of having the prominent mathematician Bernd Michael Holmby as his school teacher. Holmby recognized the potential in the young Niels and realized that the young boy was truly gifted. Thus, the teacher took it upon himself to tutor the boy and encourage his mathematical abilities. Niels's family underwent a severe crisis after 1818. Niels's father died and as a consequence, the family fell apart both emotionally and financially. Bert Michael Holmby helped Niels with a scholarship so that he could stay in school and his friends raised enough money so Niels could apply to the Royal Frederick University. Abel gained recognition as the most knowledgeable mathematician in Norway by the time he was 20. His most famous single result is the first complete proof demonstrating the impossibility of solving the general quintic equation in radicals. 
This question was one of the outstanding open problems of his day and had been unsolved for over 250 years. He was also an innovator in the field of elliptic functions and a discoverer of the abelian functions. Unfortunately, he died of tuberculosis at the age of 26. The Abel Prize in Mathematics, originally proposed in 1899 to complement the Nobel Prize, is named in his honor. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 8. Joseph Fourier Joseph Fourier was a French mathematician and physicist born in the middle of the 18th century. Coming from a humble background, he became an orphan when he was 10. At the age of 12, he entered a military school run by Benediction monks and became engrossed in mathematics. Later, he became a teacher at the same institution and joined the local revolutionary committee, a decision that almost cost him his head under the guillotine. Saved from imminent debt, he went back to teaching but was soon picked up by Napoleon to accompany him on his Egyptian expedition. He is best known for initiating the investigation of Fourier series, which eventually developed into Fourier analysis and harmonic analysis and their applications to problems of heat transfer and vibration. Fourier transform and Fourier's law of conduction is also named in his honor. Fourier is also generally credited with the discovery of the greenhouse effect. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 9. Adrien Marie Legendre Adrien Marie Legendre, a renowned French mathematician, holds a distinguishable place in the field of mathematics. Having spent his early years in extensive research work, he has various theories to his credit. Legendre's contributions to the elliptical functions, physics, and mathematical analysis had been a guiding light for various other researchers in a similar field. He served as a professor at the famous Science Institute in Paris, wherein he also did his research and brought out publications simultaneously. His major area of work covers elliptic functions, number theory, gravitational attraction, geodesy, calculus, and various other branches of mathematics. He has been honored with various titles and memberships to commemorate his contributions to the field of mathematics and physics. He developed the least square method which has wide-ranging applications in linear regression, signal processing, statistics and curve fitting. He gave the concept of Legendre transformation which used to go from Lagrangian to Hamiltonian formulation of classical mechanics. Legendre transformation is also used in thermodynamics to obtain the enthalpy and the Helmholtz and Gibbs free energies from the internal energy. Here is a list of what he was known for. Number 10. Henri Poincaré Henri Poincaré was one of France's greatest mathematicians and theoretical physicists and a philosopher of science. He is often described as a polymath and as the last universalist in mathematics because he excelled in all fields of the discipline as it existed during his lifetime. As a mathematician and physicist, he made many original fundamental contributions to pure and applied mathematics, mathematical physics, and celestial mechanics. In his research on the three-body problem, Poincaré became the first person to discover a chaotic deterministic system which laid the foundations of modern chaos theory. He is also considered to be one of the founders of the field of topology. Poincaré made clear the importance of paying attention to the invariance of laws of physics under different transformations and was the first to present the Lorentz transformations in their modern symmetrical form. Poincaré discovered the remaining relativistic velocity transformations and recorded them in a letter to Henrik Lorentz in 1905. Thus, he obtained perfect invariance of all of the Maxwell equations, an important step in the formulation of the theory of special relativity. In 1905, Poincaré first proposed gravitational waves emitting from a body and propagating at the speed of light as being required by the Lorentz transformation. 
In the early 20th century, he formulated the Poincaré conjecture that became over time one of the most famous unsolved problems in mathematics until it was solved in 2002-2003 by Gregory Perelman. Here is a list of what he was known for. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please consider liking and subscribing and do check out my other channel linked on screen. So thank you all for watching and see you soon and have an excellent rest of your day. Goodbye.